Working President of International Peace and Social Advancement, IPSA, Kurajam Athoba, has drawn the attention of global communities towards the ongoing crisis in Manipur and broader Northeast region during the ongoing 57th United Nations Human Rights Council, UNHRC, session in Geneva yesterday. Kurajam Athoba delivered his second intervention during the general debate on Agenda Item 5, titled Human Rights Situations That Require the Council's Attention. In his speech, Atoba maintained that the situation in Manipur has now surpassed 500 days of turmoil, placing the indigenous native population under severe threat. Over the past 15 months, armed groups belonging to Chin Kuki narco-terrorist groups, who are under peace talks with the government of India, have launched violent attacks using drone bombings and rockets from as far as 7 kilometers away. He said despite the deployment of over 60,000 Indian troops in the region, there has been little effective action, raising concerns of government complicity and an apparent prioritization of geopolitical interest over the security of its own native citizens. Manipur's indigenous people are now trapped in a hostage-like situation, caught between escalating violence and ineffective state protection. He called upon the council to intervene and protect the native people of Manipur and also to assign relevant mandate office and special rapporteurs to assess the ever deteriorating situation in the region and also recognize the threat of immigrant armed narco-terrorists. Chinkuki narco-terrorist groups who are under peace talks with the government of India have launched violent attacks using drone bombings and rockets from as far as 7 kilometers away. The situation has escalated to a different level, targeting civilian areas resulting in several deaths and destruction of properties. Recent alerts reported by the chairman of the Unified Command confirms that approximately 900 Kuki militants have infiltrated Manipur from across the Indo-Myanmar border, planning coordinated assaults against the native population. Despite the deployment of over 60,000 Indian troops in the region, there has been little effective action, raising concerns of government complicity and an apparent prioritization of geopolitical interests over the security of its own native citizens, Manipur's indigenous people are now trapped in a hostage-like situation caught between escalating violence and ineffective state protection. This is not just a regional crisis, it is a grave human rights emergency with far-reaching implications threatening the very existence of one of the oldest civilizations in Southeast Asia. We urge this council to intervene to protect the native people of Manipur where the Indian government has failed till date, to assign relevant mandate office and special rapporteurs to assess the ever-deteriorating situations in the region, and also to recognize the threat of immigrant armed narco-terrorism and take necessary actions to stop it from spiraling further. We urgently seek your immediate attention. Thank you.